let me just start this video by saying I hope I don't say anything offensive. I feel bad that I got to come on here and even try to walk on eggshells because you can't even like say too much these days about certain people. Not even saying it in a malicious way, but you say anything that they don't like. You know how them people get down. And you know they're going to bring out the whole community on you and the whole, and all the letters. They coming to get you. They coming to fucking get you. So I'm going to tread lightly. I don't want no problems. I don't want no smoke, but I'm going to say some shit, and you motherfuckers ain't going to shut me up, and I'm, I'm going I'm to be, I'm going to be, uh, um, as careful, but I'm going to no be daddy. as transparent as necessary without all that bullshit, pussy ass shit that I'm doing right now. Welcome back to the channel, Ball Here Take Four Wings of Fries. Hit them likes, subscribes, notifications, notification bells, all of that so you can get these vibes back in the building with the immaculate feeling you already did. Know what it is. And if you don't, you plain fucking stupid. This is no Connors media. I want to talk about Elon Musk and his transgender daughter slash his son. Son that he was born as. Talking about his daddy was me. Well, her daddy was mean, and he was cruel, and he was an absent father. Let me read it. Let me read it. Elon Musk's transgender daughter said that the Tesla owner was an absent father who frequently rebuked her for being queer and feminine as a child. That sentence is just fucked up. We, I'm going to dissect this article, but that sentence is fucked up. Elon Musk, transgender daughter, said that the Tesla, the Tesla CEO was an absent father who frequently rebuked her for being queer and feminine. Uh, if, mis, don't, now, now, hold on. Now, if I'm not mistaken, queer is the word for, for the man, right? When he gay as shit, he, he, he queer, right? So you a boy, so he didn't like you for being queer. So and then you talk about and, and then feminine as a child. So you a boy. <laughs> I'm about to stop walking on eggshells and say what the fuck I want to say. So what do you what do you mean? You stop saying she. I, you are a boy. <laughs> And then he didn't like you acting feminine, as I think most fathers of the world wouldn't like it. Predominantly, all fathers wouldn't want their son acting like no little hoe, walking around here, skipping, dancing, hand movements, and all of that. You're a father. You want your son to be sonning, not daughtering. In an exclusive interview with NBC News, Vienna Jenna Wilson, 20 years old, said that Musk was cruel, a cruel father who was only around maybe 10% of the time, despite sharing custody of Wilson and her twin brother with his ex-wife, Justine Musk. Now, him being absent is probably the reason why Shorty walking around like this and doing these things and feeling hella feminine. Because he probably around mommy, aunties, grandmommies, all that, sisters and all of that his whole life. And that is the energy that he's receiving. And that's the energy that's going to flow back out. You feel me? So that's it's probably his fault of why he don't even like his own son, a daughter, whatever the fuck you want to be called. Because like, like everybody said, you, you can be what you want. Be free. Yay! Her. Come on. If you got nuts, you with him. Um, let me finish this, man. Let me finish this. 
Musk and his lawyers did not immediately respond to the request for comment from Business Insider. In the interview with NBC, Wilson described Musk as being an unsupportive parent for as long as she, he could remember. I'm not supporting it. I don't, I'm, I don't, I, I don't hate nobody. But I ain't got to condone everybody like what, what the fuck everybody do. Motherfuckers like shrimp on a pizza. I don't like motherfuckers who, they, who like shrimp on a pizza. I don't hate you. It's just I don't like what you do. Like, and then I ain't got to support it. If you, if you want fucking shrimp on your pizza, then you say, hey, look, <coughs> Tay, can you buy me a pizza with some shrimp on it? I'm the fuck not going to buy you no shrimp pizza because I don't fuck with it and I don't support it. I'll get you a pepperoni pizza. You know why? Because I like pepperoni. I support pepperoni. And I'm for pepperoni things. I don't like shrimp on pizza. I don't like Alfredo on pizza. So I'm not I'm not supporting that shit. Same thing. Do I hate it? No. Do I hate the people who buy that nasty shit? Pineapple pizza eating motherfuckers? Do I hate them? No. I just don't fuck with it. And I don't support it. Don't bring it the fuck around me. Why can't we say that out loud like I'm doing? <laughs> anyway, he was cold, she said. He's very quick to anger and he is uncaring and a narcissist. Wilson said must regularly criticize her for displaying traditionally feminine qualities throughout her childhood. She, I'm tired of saying she, it's a boy. I'm bothered. You are what you would like the quick lesson. You are what you are. You was born as a boy. You came out with dick and balls, man. You came out with a wet hole, woman. End of fucking story. There's just too much confusion. I'm not mad. Don't don't don't, don't let me come in. I'm not mad. It's just confusion. All you letter motherfuckers, let me know in the comments. Am I bugging? Let me know your dislike and your disdain for me right now for voicing my fucking opinion. Let me know. Because I don't understand. And I ain't going to understand. And I don't want to understand. I don't, I don't. It's wild confusion. He, she, him, it, that, all this bullshit. Like what it is. What it is is what it is. And what it ain't is what it ain't and what it ain't going to be. And what it was is... Not what it is. I don't know. The fuck? Anyway, she recalled a road trip she took with Musk when she was in the fourth grade, which she said was essentially an advertisement for one of his vehicles, during which she said Musk was constantly and viciously yelling at her because her voice was too high. Hey, daddy. Daddy. Motherfucker. 14 years old, daddy! I shouldn't have did that. I shouldn't have did that. <laughs> I shouldn't have did that, my bad. Uh, it was cruel, she told the outlet. Wilson spoke publicly about her relationship with Musk for the first time this week in a response to comments he made about her in an interview with conservative commentator and Canadian psychologist Jordan Peterson on Monday that was on a live stream. Um, let me see. During the discussion, Musk talked about his relationship with Wilson, repeatedly misgendering her, referring to her by her dead name. What the fuck is the dead name? Bitch, this is the name that I gave you. This is the name you was book. My, my fucking head almost exploded. My fucking head almost exploded. Pause, no diddy and all of that, but my fucking head just almost exploded. Misgendering her? You misgendering yourself, you stupid motherfucker. What'd I say? You was born dick balls, boy. Now you wanna run around here because your daddy wasn't around, and now you wanna walk around talking about you this and you that, and you talking about motherfucker is misgendering you. You wanna be called what the fuck you wanna be called, but that ain't what the fuck it is. That ain't what the fuck it is. And a legend that he was tricked. 
into approving trans-related medical care for her when she was 16 years old. Now, I ain't gonna say that, Elon. How the fuck you get tricked into getting some, some surgery for your son? For some trans, for some trans-related uh, surgery? Like, what you mean you was tricked? I lost my son, essentially, Musk said in the interview. The reason it's called dead naming is because your son is dead. He added that he believed Wilson to be dead, killed by the woke mind virus. Wilson has stayed out of the public eye until now, told NBC News that Musk's comments went too far. I think he was under the assumption that I wasn't going to say anything and I would just let things go unchallenged, Wilson told the outlet, which I'm not going to do because if you're going to lie about me, like blatantly to an audience of millions, I'm just not going to let that shit slide. Wilson told the outlet that her mother was very supportive of her desire to start treatment for, sever for severe gender dysphoria. What the fuck is that? What the fuck? Hey, hey, let the people out there, what is that? What is severe gender dysphoria treatment? Is that where you get your shit chopped off and you get a pussy placed there? Or like, what's going on? Or you had a pussy and then you get a dick grew out your pussy? Like, what's going on? I know I sound hella ignorant right there, but maybe I am. Maybe I am. But let me know. Let me know, because what the fuck? And of course, mothers are more supportive of the dumb shit when the boys, they want to be coddling little boys and shit, and mommy's boys and shit, but you don't know, you you hurting them, you 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 hurting them by always coddling them, letting them all lay up on you, talking to them nicely all the fucking time, you is bitching them up, and that's why these motherfucking kids is getting bitched up, they turning out certain type of ways, and not masculine, I ain't talking then and when it's time to be masculine, soft motherfuckers always talking about, oh, that's toxic masculinity, you shouldn't be, then shut your bitch ass up, now that was toxic, but shut your bitch ass up, ain't nobody want to hear all that, When the pandemic happened, Wilson said that she saw it as an escape from Musk and an excuse to not see him, calling it lucky timing, needing her father's authorization. However, Wilson says she tested, text him, she, she tests with Musk. Man, fuck this video. Fuck that. Fuck him. Her. Whatever the fuck. Fuck Elon Musk too, because you should have been in your child life, and that's probably why he doing the stuff that you don't like because you were absent. So you got to take some blame in this. You got to take responsibility for your role. You feel me? So his son daughter saying, look, you was an unsupportive motherfucker and you were never there. So let me know. To anybody else out there in the community who feel like that, if your daddy said, look, I'm not fucking with you right now because you're doing this stupid ass shit and you want to be a little girl, I'm out. Let me know how that made you feel in the comments down below. I'm your man, boy. It's, well, I'm not your man. I'm not your man. <laughs> I, I'm your I'm your uh your media outlet entertainment source guy. Yeah, that's who I am. No condoms media. And I don't even want to say no condoms media with you people, but I guess you people do need to be wearing condoms. Everybody need to wear condoms. Stay safe. The only time it should be no condoms is when you here with me. I don't like the way that sound either. I'm just out. I'm out. I'm out.